Hi friends, it's Valerie. Welcome back to my channel and welcome back to this week's grocery haul. If you are new here, I would love if you would hit that subscribe button and join my YouTube family. And don't forget to leave a like or a comment down below because it really does help my channel. Um, this week's grocery haul is pretty small. I basically just got what I needed for recipes and not much of anything else because I am fully stocked on things. I kind of need to go through and organize some stuff and before I do any major shopping. Also, I just wanted to make a note to all of you who watch my grocery hauls that next week I won't have a grocery haul, most likely. And that's because um, I'm going to be buying things, but I have to edit in advance to participate in a open collab the following week with everybody else. So I have to edit that in advance so I can upload it in advance. So that will mean that I won't have one for you most likely next week, but watch out for that next one the following week because it should be a great one. Um, anyways, let's just get started. Okay, this stuff is going to be from Albertsons and Superior, which is like another grocery store near me, but they have really great produce deals, so I went there for all the produce I needed, and uh, anyways, I grabbed four Powerade in the Fruit Punch flavor, got five of the Smart Water uh, Cucumber Lime Waters, I really love those, got a 12 pack of Modelo, some chicken breast, it's on sale this week and I need it for this recipe, which this recipe will probably be out before you see this clip because I've already put my grocery haul out for the week, um, but I forgot to get some things and I wasn't going to get to this store in time. Um, I grabbed a few uh, poblano peppers, some tomatillos, the skins don't look very great, but that part comes off anyways, I already looked under there, they're fine. Got a few limes, some jalapenos, some radishes, some tostada shells. That's a non-grocery item, but I just got a box of tissues. Um, these Lifesaver mints, I really love them. And I love that they're individually wrapped because I can throw them in my purse. Uh, I found the footlong uh, archer stick, so I grabbed one of those. Then some Simply Potatoes, two of the diced ones. I like to keep those on hand, quick, easy breakfasts. Some cilantro. And then these like wheel chips, they're really good. So um, we, we get them sometimes like fresh, like people that vendors like walk around and like sell them. But we tried these ones from this store and they're actually really good, like nice and fresh. So got two bags of those, a uh, white onion and some sour cream. All right, this is all going to be from Albertsons. I got some of this Lindy's homemade Italian ice, the watermelon and strawberry flavored ones. These are really good. And got more of the Smart Waters, the cucumber lime. I just got what they had left, which was seven of them. Uh, I got some chicken breast. Uh, today was the last day for the sale, so I did grab some of that to stock up a little bit. And then I got some corn tortillas some snacking tomatoes, some kimchi for a recipe, couple Roma tomatoes, couple shallots, got a thing of cut up watermelon, some squeezed ginger, that's also going to be used in a recipe, and then got a couple of the Buttig Premium Deli lunch meats, just the smoked turkey breasts, some asparagus, broccoli, some spinach, an English cucumber, got some celery. This is all gonna be, or most of this is going to be for like a um, like a little smoothie in the morning type thing. And then I got some French bread. That smells amazing. It's fresh and it smells so good. And I literally just wanna pull off a piece right now with some butter, like I think I'm gonna do that because we don't typically use the whole French bread anyways, so a little snack won't hurt. And then, a Caesar salad kit. I like this supreme one. It's really good. And then some artisan hot dog buns. I was craving a chili dog like so bad. I love chili dogs. So how to get some buns for that. And then I have a personalized price for rice. So I did grab like the Mahatma rice, the jasmine. This is, it's like, it was my personalized price was four something. And even Walmart's like about seven dollars for it. So um, that's a great deal and we do love rice so I grabbed six of those I was an unlimited amount that you could get I just got what they had left it's also a good stock up item I do like to keep you know pantry stable items and rice is one of those things I like to definitely keep a good stock on because it's very filling and we really enjoy it you can make so many things using rice as well 
Okay, and here's the meal plan for the week. Sunday, we already had just some leftovers, and Monday, we had takeout. Um, then, I'm for Tuesday, I'm making some crab linguine and just salad and bread with that. And then another night, we're going to make, or I'm going to make, Tex-Mex chicken and rice. It's actually a recipe that I saw over on Taylor Elmore's channel a couple times, but I saved it so that I could make it in the future. So I want to give that a try. And then... Another night we'll have beef bulgogi bowls and some, like I saw a recipe for like garlic bok choy. That sounded good. And then another night salmon, some rice and salad. And then I've been just craving a chili dog. So I am going to make some chili cheese dogs, probably just like some tater tots or home fries or something like that. I did get most of the things that I needed today at the grocery store, but they didn't have any like steak that I... It looked good so I'm gonna go check that out in like a day or so here and see if maybe they restock or just go to a different store and then um, again same with the bok choy they were all out so I'll have to find we have a lot of Asian markets around here so I can go to one if my gro local grocery store doesn't like stock back up and then I just forgot parsley when I was there so I will have to grab some of that um, I will leave this meal plan downloadable in the description box down below and I'll remove the shopping list part of it for you guys if that matters. Thanks so much for watching friends. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and that little bell so you don't miss out on any future videos and I hope you all have a great day.